Hi, Dr. Todd Sullivan from Nova Chiropractic and Acupuncture. There are seven key movements to a good exercise program. So that's going to be the lunge pattern, a squat pattern, a hinge pattern, a push, a pull, a carry, and a core exercise. You can basically make an entire program based on those seven movements, and we can make it either more challenging or less challenging based on your skill level. So the first pattern we're gonna go over is a lunge pattern. So with a lunge pattern, what we're gonna do is we're gonna use a veil slide, which is like a, basically like a furniture mover that allows your foot to slide back, and we're gonna do like what we call a reverse lunge. So a reverse lunge, what we're gonna do is we're gonna use the veil side, we'll put, use the left side first. She's gonna put her toe in the middle of the veil slide, and all she's gonna do is she's gonna lunge back with the um, leg on this side, Good, and touch her knee to the ground and come back up. And let's have you do that again. She's keeping her back really vertical this entire time. And her right foot is nice and vertical, the shin there, so she's not putting stress on her knees. A lot of times when we lunge forward, uh, we do that pattern, it puts a lot more strain on the knees. This is a safer pattern for your knees, and it's also safe for your back. Let's do a couple more reps here. Good, you can see she's got good, good range of motion, her back's nice and straight throughout the whole exercise. Now what we can do is we can add some weight to make it a little bit more challenging. So we're gonna add a little bit of weight to this and then we're gonna do the valve side again and we'll show you that. This would be the next progression up and then we can just keep adding and adding more weight to make it more difficult. So now we're gonna add weight to the reverse lunge to make it more difficult. So here we're gonna have the patient grab a kettlebell. This is 18 pounds. You can use whatever weight you're comfortable, five pounds to start off with and then we can go up. And, and that'll increase as you get stronger here. So she, on the side that she's gonna reverse lunge with, she's gonna hold the weight on that side. So she's gonna go down and reverse lunge and then come back up. Perfect. Again, the form should look the same whether she's using 18 pounds or whether she's using 60 pounds. She should have good form throughout this whole process. That looks great. And back and come back up and relax. One more thing we can do is we can put our arm out to the side, for the right side there, to make it more, give you more stability. If you feel yourself wobbling a little bit, putting your arm out, making a fist, keeping your body tight throughout this exercise will make it more easy. This is a really good exercise to help develop the um, single leg strength in your glutes and in your hips. And it also is a fundamental movement for many other um, exercises we're gonna do.